Commissioner Aloiso Falcao of the Rio de Janeiro Police and uh, one of the lead investigators in this case. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Um, How are are you? Good, thank you. And uh, you are well, I hope, also. Are you aware, Commissioner, that in Ireland um, this has been the biggest story in the last 10 days? Yeah, yeah. Um, why, why did you decide to film the arrest of Pat Hickey? Yeah, because we, we, we knew that Pat Hickey was the guy who suggested the name of EAG to the real 2016. We talked to the, the Donovan Ferretti, who was the director of the, the ticket, and he, he told to the police that Pat Hickey was the guy who suggested the, the TG. As the TG was rejected... Oh. Okay, that, that, that's, of, uh, 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 Commissioner, that's all, that's all fine, but in Ireland that's not a crime. It's not a crime, and it's not a crime for Pat Hickey to be in communication with Marcus Evans. It's not a crime. Why did you decide to film, to video, to bring along a cameraman to film Pat Hickey in the middle of the night, a 71-year-old man, obviously in distress? Why did you decide to film and release that video? Yeah, in Brazil, uh, ticket touting is a crime, you know. In Brazil, it's a crime. I have to respect the Brazilian law. Okay, yeah, no, yeah, I, 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 of course, it's a, it's a crime in Brazil. It's not a crime in Ireland. But uh, some people believe it should be a crime in Ireland, I hasten to add. But why did you film the arrest of Pat Hickey? Yeah, I did his arrest because I have to respect the law. It was a, is every it was is every a, a is, is every is every arrest in Brazil filmed? No, not not everyone. But this is so. A why did question, why you did know? you why did you film this man being arrested? Yeah, my friend. What I, what I can talk to you that I had I had to 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 do what the judges. Uh, gave to me the warrant, you know. Okay. When, did we, it, did it, had, did, did, when did, we arrested him, yeah. I, I sent him to the hostel to check the, the all, okay. all, all, all his health. He spent the hostel one day because we, we knew I that understand, he had and some that's, uh, uh, cardio problems. Very good, you know? very good, very good. That's important. Why did you decide and who filmed this man in distress in his, in his bedroom? Ah, uh, mm. Ah, because he wasn't at, at the hotel in his bedroom, you know. We had a, a, a judge warrant, so we had to, to do it. Uh, and he wasn't in his room. His wife was in another room, and mm-hmm. he was in, in, in a different room from his wife. And his wife told to the police that he would... Uh, that you went back to, to, to Ireland, you know. Well, she, as, as I said last week when all of this was happening, um, it, yeah. th- th- there might have been a, a misunderstanding. It's a different language. Are you saying the judge ordered that the arrest of Pat Hickey be filmed? Yeah. He did? It's, it's, a, it's a judge, yeah. The judge says, I want to see video and film evidence. I want to see the film the movie of this man being arrested. No, this is not by not a, a judge order. You know, it's a, like a media. We we didn't authorize the, the media. You know. And commissioner, where does the investigation stand now? Is there any possibility, uh, as far as you know, that Pat Hickey, who, as you pointed out, is a seventy-one-year-old man, and you have to call the doctor, that uh, Pat Hickey could be released on bail and? out of that prison? Yeah, in, in Brazilian law, the, we have a kind of a domiciliar prison when the guy is older than 80 years or when he has a bad health. Okay. His lawyers are trying to get this, this kind of prison okay. for him to be so, so in, can I ask, in, in, in his home. So can I ask you, Commissioner, on behalf of the, the Rio de Janeiro police, would you object if the judge said, can I release this man for prison, from prison and put him under, as you say, domiciliary uh, containment or whatever? Would you object, Commissioner? No. No. Okay. So, so you, your decision. you would be in favour of Pat Hickey being released from prison once he does not leave Rio de Janeiro. Is that correct? Yeah. 
for sure. The, the, the Brazilian police uh, is not unfair. I, I can tell you about the Dermot Hanham. I, I, I heard him uh, okay. on Tuesday, Have and today I'm going to talk to the judge to, okay. to leave the, his, his passport, to give it back, you know. So are you, you are prepared to talk to the judge today to say that you have no objection yeah. to Pat Hickey being released. Um, have you any objection to him leaving Brazil? Yeah, he has to stay in Brazil too because you have more questions about more people who are being investigated. I mean, Kevin Cutie, Stephen Martin, others. You know, he can be at the, at the domiciliar uh, jail. We, I, we don't have object about, about it, but this is a judge decision. I can't decide that. Okay, know? but can you can can you encourage if if it comes to this? It's your own decision, as you say. But can is it within your power to say to the judge, we will allow Pat, Hick, Pat Hickey live in a a hotel or whatever in Rio once we hold on to his passport and he cannot leave Brazil? Is that your question? Is that, is that your your uh, opinion? Uh, you, you are saying if I have the power to talk to the judge just to release him from the jail. Yes, but once he stays in Brazil. Yeah, well, we, we don't we don't have this power. You know, this is a, a just decision. Okay, this but you, right. so approximately, Commissioner, when do you hope to hand uh, uh, to hand the file to the judge and say we've done all our investigations? Now you decide. When is that? A week? A month? Or how long do you think that might take? Months. Uh, I, I can tell you maybe between one and three months. Between one and three. Okay. I hope so. You know, one so, and three months. I think is going to be. Uh, on the court. Okay. So if Mr. Hickey, which he, which he vehemently asserts, as does Mr. Mallon, that they are innocent, you're saying w- we will not have a decision on that from the Brazilian system <coughs> for up to three months? Yeah, but they, they say they are innocent for sure. It's obviously, yeah. right? Um, we have a decision to, to, keep, to keep them arrested to the Brazilian court, you know, it's, it's a Brazilian law, I don't know how it works in Ireland, you know, but in Brazil it's, it's like a, a kind of a rap that happens uh, for the people that don't run away from their country, you know, because otherwise it's going to be like, impossible to, 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 to inquire them. Okay. Have, you, uh, have you asked Interpol to help? Yeah, for sure. What have you asked them? I'm in contact to with the Interpol. I am in contact with the Interpol. And the Interpol is going to to help the Brazilian police, the civil police. And what country are Interpol going to ask to assist the Brazilian police? Yeah, the Interpol, it's based in France. You yes, know, I know I, that. I, I yeah, in, the, the, it's based. The, the Interpol in, it's based in Lyon. Yeah. But are you are you saying to Interpol? Can we get information from Ireland? I, I can't tell you. I can't. I can't tell you about this information. You know, but what I can tell you is that I I, I, I made contact with the Interpol, and they are helping the the, the Brazilian police. Okay. Yeah. Have you had any representations from the Irish government? No. That's why I, I, I also want to, to get some help from, from you guys from the media because we need some help from the government. I know that Shane Ross would uh, have a, 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 a meeting with Patrick Hickey, but he has left. I, I also want to know about the government position, about the, the, the inquiry that they are doing, you know. The police can help, and police can be helped from the government. We can we can change information, trade information about this scandal. You know, and have if you, they want but, but, to contact the Brazilian police, yeah, it would be great. But have you have you contacted the Irish government via via our embassy uh, in Rio and in? Uh, Not yet. But you're I, saying you, you you're I, saying. I, you, I, you're saying you want to speak to Shane Ross and you want to speak to the Irish government. And do you, do you want to speak to the Irish police? Yeah, it would be great to, to switch information. It's great for the inquiry because, as I say, uh, 
we need the, 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 the much more information is better. It's more fair for the for the process, you know. We don't we want we don't want to be unfair. Well, I say I have to okay. know what what happened in the government in, in Ireland and also the government. I think they want to know what happened in Brazil. I think well, it, it, well, a number for both. Well, just commissioner, a number of politicians in Ireland have said some in opposition, some in government, uh, have said they were, one senior minister, uh, Simon Coveney, um, Shane Ross made a reference to it as well, and the leader, one of the, lead, the leader of the Labour Party here said, this is not the way we do things in Ireland. I'm quoting one, the leader of the Labour Party. This is not the way we do things in Ireland. Can you understand that the arrest of this man, the filming of the arrest the uh, immediate removal, okay, you took him to a hospital, um, and then his incarceration in this prison, that to some people in Ireland, indeed to a lot of people, I think, in fairness, they don't think that it, that is very fair. Mm, I know what I can tell you, but the police treated him very well. We, 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 we left him in the hospital for one day, he only went to the prison, to the prison, when the doctor examined him and said, "Well, now he's okay." Every, every, every act that I did in my investigation, I talked to him and his lawyers always. Okay, always, okay, okay. You know? the, just, just you know this this cocktail party, this operation, this sting operation, where you sent undercover policemen to this cocktail party. Does that mean you have been uh, on the... When did this case open? Did it open when the Olympics started or a few days beforehand? Or did it open a few years ago? How long have you been on this case? Uh, it, 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 it's like two years. Because right. we had a, 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 another investigation in 2014 at the World Cup football. And we arrested the James Sinton. He's a director from the TAG, and we knew that the TAG was trying to get credential for the Olympic Games. Okay. That's why we, we, we started the, 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 the investigation two years ago. Okay, so you were, wa you were watching THG before the Olympics. Yeah. You had a file. Were you, before they arrived, were you, wa were you aware of the arrival of the Irish Olympic Committee? Were you were you suspicious of a connection then? Yeah, I can tell you. The Olympic Island uh, Council was only <coughs> suspect suspicious when we we found maybe eight hundred tickets, okay. and all those tickets with Ken James Marlow was this data for the Irish. Okay, so, so is it fair to say that before Pat Hickey and indeed Kevin Mallon and other people that you've now said you want their passports, before they arrived in Rio de Janeiro, you were not suspicious of them? You were not suspicious no. of them? Okay. You only became no. interested in them when you found these tickets at this uh, cocktail party, as you describe it? Yeah, correct. Just to be clear, all the tickets you found in this undercover sting operation, are you saying all the tickets you found were only from the Irish Olympic Council? Only from Irish Olympic Only from Irish, okay. Oh, and more if, than 1,050. 1,050, okay. Why did you put Pat Hickey's passport and his boarding cards and his accreditation, why did you put them on your table for those photographs that you were at? I, I didn't put the passport on my table. It's like the media to to put. Ah, the, no, to no, no, hang on, hang on, you know? hang on, hang on. The media didn't have his passport. You had his passport. Why did you put his passport yeah, on the table? Yeah, it's okay in Brazil to show what what we we like. We and what you have, okay. We confiscate, and, and you know. We is, is the things, and the media can take this photo. Okay, it's, okay, that's the way in the Brazil. Constitution okay, here. okay. And do you, do you, did Pat Hickey have a second passport? Yeah, he has a second passport. Um, he gave to the police. Yeah. And where is that? It what? was a very good intention uh, uh, for him. And is the second passport Irish? 
Yeah, I think so. But you can't have two you passports, have two passports. And, and both both passports were valid. Yeah, yeah. I uh, think because he, he travels a lot, man. Maybe he has a, a spare, second passport. A spare one. Yeah, but it's you, okay. you, but you, but you, but you, yeah, but you're you're adamant it wasn't a false passport. It was it was a spare passport. No, it's it's original. It's a true passport. I know, but there there's nothing wrong with that. Is there? <laughs> nothing wrong. Okay. 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 Nothing wrong. Okay, Commissioner. Th- thank you for your time. Okay. Thank you. I okay. appreciate also. Okay. And, and sorry uh, for the question that I, that I, that I didn't answer. Uh, it's, it's difficult to talk, talk before uh, okay. another language. <laughs> okay. Well, do do you before given given to the question, given given that you raised the question, you didn't answer. Do you regret? Are you sorry that you let the cameras in to film this seventy-one-year-old man in distress? No, because I, I, okay. I didn't I didn't authorize that. You know. The media, it, it's a problem between this uh, hotel okay. security. Do you carry? Hotel security, I'll, 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 do you carry a gun? I, I, I can tell you, I, I didn't like what happened between his, 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 why didn't his you tell, video. Why didn't you tell them? Rat. Well, then why didn't you tell why? the media? You have a gun on you in the in the photographs. Why didn't when, you tell? Why didn't you tell the media? Why didn't you tell the media to get lost? The media went there. The media know in Brazil is very fast. A lot of television okay. went there, and then they, they saw the police, and they they enter in, 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 in the hotel. The security didn't, didn't oh, stop okay. them. What I can tell you, when the Pachki was arrested, we didn't put anything on him. We went from the basement, from the basement with the ambulance. I authorized that. He asked me, "Oh, commissioner, can I go from the basement because of the, the media?" Okay. And he, and I said, yeah, for sure, you are, we are going to okay. the basement. Nobody saw him going to the jail. Okay, but he, yeah, okay. Him. Nobody okay. saw him And you were saying Pat Hickey requested that he be taken out of the the hotel privately? Yeah, from the basement. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. He, he okay. left the hotel by the basement okay. and authorized that. Okay, Commissioner... Uh, Alessio Falcao, uh, lead investigator with the Rio de Janeiro Police. Uh, obrigado and thank you again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.